go as slow as shadow on the mic I play to win, never to lose In the contest of champions I'm the one that shoes Swipe straight down, my moves are slick Dexterity more heavily, I dodge quick Class champ, I'm the master of the game Cosmic science, skill tech mutant I claim Arena and chill grind, that's how I roll No stress, no drama, just on patrol The fight, I'm swift, my tactics excite Lost shadows in the arena, ready to ignite From the streets to the screen, my skills are renowned in the world of Marvel, I'm the King Crown. So listen up, here's the story of the champ, Lord Shadow's the name. I'm the Grime Track fan. Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So this is Summer of Suffering, part four, and this video has all the objectives done. And I was not going to put this up at first. I didn't put out a part three, maybe I'll do it at some point in time, I don't know. But I watched some videos, and let me warn y'all right now, no solo. I have found that these fights with some of these nodes can be real stressful if I try to get a solo, all right? So I looked at all the nodes, watched some videos, and I'm like, okay, it doesn't seem to be that bad. So I'll boost up. And you'll see how many revives I have in my overflow. Why would I want to try to get a solo when I'm selling off these revives? Better to just have a nice, relaxing, get these things done. Okay, so this fight here. The only thing that I found to be somewhat annoying his regen the reverse controls and of course the root if you know anything about me you know how i feel about root it triggers me okay so one thing about juggernaut he is immune to the reverse controls so i don't have to worry about the reverse controls i just have to worry about the root so look at that already down to 77% health. Pretty straightforward and easy, right? Um, I watched some people get solos with Juggernaut. If I felt like it, I probably could, but I don't feel like it. Now, what you're watching is my very, very first time going in here. I hit record, and that's what you're seeing in this video. So I'm not getting used to the fight, nothing. Just going in, hammering it out, okay? Now, one thing that was highly annoying that made this fight less fun than it could have been was the AI. He refused to throw his specials and I ain't got that kind of time. So that's what you see me doing right here. I'm like, fine, you don't want to throw your special? I don't care. Bam, bam. And we just go, go. That's it. Don't throw your special, you know? Let's just go get as much damage as we can get done. All right, yep. He's giving me a little bit more damage there. And then he fires his special three. The AI for this toad is horrible when it comes to those specials. And this is a problem that we have found often in the game. But because I am not trying to get a solo and I'm not trying to stress myself out, you see what I did. I recommend if you have the revives, just go ahead and do it, knock it out. The rewards are worth it. Now I'm just using free revives. So if you don't have the revives and you have to use some uh, units, that's fine. The rewards are worth it. So here we go. You notice that I didn't even try to heal all the way back up. Don't matter. All right, look at this, bam, bam, bam. Who cares? All right, we knocking them down, all right? Now, I backed up a little bit because I don't want him on that um, edge there on the right-hand side to get so many uh, re um, regenerations. One nice thing, though, is that due to one of the nodes, he can't regen past where he started the fight. So you won't get stuck, okay? Uh, I got stuck in the corner. Again, he would not fire his special. Got into the corner. And then he just hit me with a heavy. 
I'm just like, whatever. All right. Now, this video is at the five minute mark and he's almost done. So I'm all about that fast speed. I don't like long fights. I'm running recoil, double edge and liquid courage, and I boost it up. I want it done quick. Now, in some of the later fights, I actually had to learn the fight a little bit. All right. See, look at this. Just trying to get him to fire a special. All right. Look at this. Look at this. I'm like, what in the world is going on? Just fire your special. All right. And then I, I honestly don't even know what happened there. You guys can tell me what happened. Um, I, I, if I remember correctly, it has something to do with my um, assassin mastery and the interaction with this node, because I do have assassin on. Um, uh, if I remember right, it's something when you suppress his uh, one of his abilities or whatever, that's what happens. You take some direct damage. All right. But when I was fighting, I was like, okay, just die. Great. But that's why I'm not trying to go for a solo. Can you imagine if I was doing all this and went right down to the end and then that happened and I was trying to get a solo and I'm not changing my masteries using units to do that. Got him down. What? Six minutes, 40 seconds. And we're done with that uh, objective. I'm good with that. I'm very, very good with that. All right, so Juggernaut, he was really straightforward. You just go in, get him down, okay? Now, if you want the solo, you better learn some strategy, and I'll talk a little bit about the strategy um, in a little bit here, all right? So the next one is Hulkling. Now, Hulkling, what you want to do to get your damage is while you're unblockable, you want to fire off that special uh, two, okay? Now, now that we're fighting not with Juggernaut, you have to worry about the reverse controls and the root. You also want to know that when you intercept, it will invalidate some of his prowess. Okay. Other than that, all I was doing was going in. That's it. You know, pulling him back from the edge and trying to set this up. Now, if you look, you see it, um, it looks like a red hand or whatever, kind of like a hand grabbing your leg. That's when it's going to be a root on his special. Okay. Whenever he decides to throw his special. All right. Now it's going to be reverse controls. So what I recommend is bait out the special one when it's root. All right. Now see here, I don't want him to fire his special one, but of course he does. And that's what happens. All right. You don't want to do that if you can help it. But of course, I'm just like, let me, I got a bunch of these. Well, let's use them. Okay. But what you want to do is bait out the special one when it's root, bait out the special two when it's reverse controls. Because when it's reverse controls, all you have to do is dash, dash, dash forward when it's reverse controls to evade his um, special two. Way easier to evade. Um, you don't want to uh, do the special two when you're rooted. That's likely to get you taken out. I don't think I can evade his special two. If I practice, maybe. Um, but the special one, easy to evade when you're rooted. The special two, easy to evade when you're um, dealing with reverse control. All right, see? So now, what I'm trying to do is build up to the special two while I'm unblockable. And look at that. Look at that chunk, chunk of health. Okay? And look at that. Bam, bam, bam. Now, he's at his special two. Oh! Oh! And then I messed up because it was reverse controls and I forgot. Um, again, this is raw. I am learning the fight 
as I go. All right. So we already got one objective down. And we're doing this one. Um, and we're getting them down. It's not taking that many uh, revives. And it's going pretty quickly. All right. So here we go. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. We're just, we're just having ourselves a ball. Look at that. All right. So now at this point, I want to bait out the special one if he decides to throw it. There we go. Now, what I want to do, I really want to try to get that special two off when he goes um, unblockable. So I have the uh, cosmic charges. So I just need him to block. All right. There we go. Bam. Fire off that special two. Uh, no, uh, a lot of crits, but that's okay. And then here we go. Push him to a special two. And that's perfect. Now I have to... There you go. Look at that. Easy when you remember. Okay? That's how you want to do it. All right? So now I want to get another special two, if I can. All right? Got enough cosmic charges for the uh, unblockable. Here we go. Here we go. Bam! Another. Still. Okay, we got one crit in there. And I'm holding block so that he won't throw his special, all right? And see, now I wanna to try to get away from him. And bam, I forgot that it was Root. See what happened? And he went to a special two and I got wrecked, okay? Root, special two, not a good combo. I should have just went ahead and fired off another special two uh, and got what damage I could, but um, again, I'm learning this fight. Okay? So, that's pretty much what we're doing with um, Hulkling. If you play it slower, which is what I don't like doing, you can do much better. Learn the fight. Do what I was saying, that strategy. Okay? Um, as you see here, I'm just letting my uh, cosmic charges get up. See, it invalidated some of his prowess. And see, at this point, he was going to fire that off. He was going to fire off that special one um, when it's reversed. And I don't want him to do that. All right? So here we go. There we go. That's what I wanted him to do. Okay? And we're getting lucky because that assassin hadn't kicked in. All right? So here we go. All right? I want him to block. There we go. Assassin. Isn't that fun? I finally set him up. I was like, yeah, I'm going to hit him with that special too. And he's going down. And that's when the assassin kicked in. Is what it is. I accept it. It's annoying, but I accept it. I would rather use a free revive than to mess with my units. Okay? I am saving my units for the future. Banquet event, something. Okay? And so now he's at 1%, bam, got him down. All right? Not too terribly bad, okay? Um, the next one, I actually wanted to try something because Viv Vision is definitely a great option for this. I don't have Viv Vision ranked up. And I made the decision on the last level up not to take her up. And I just, I could have taken her up just for this fight. But what you need, and you're going to see me do the filter, is a small champion that also is control denial. That's the other objective. And I, and I don't remember, I think that's just Valiant um, for that one. Okay. Uh, and one thing you got to remember, see, there's control denial. Did you see that I clicked on the selected all? You have to do both, small and control denial. And so I was looking here, and I'm like, Enchantress, no. Dust, maybe. I was thinking dust, because someone told me dust can work. You see my vid vision down there. But then I was like, you know, Claire. Maybe Claire can work. Let's check, let's check uh, Claire, see how well she does. Again, still learning the fight. And I'm like, well, I can go into her Curse of Plague and I'll be poison immune. 
and maybe that will do it, right? Okay, so I go in and I'm getting a feel for it. I'm like, all right, all right, he's just hitting me, just throwing all kind of things in me. And I'm like, really? Really? So I'm just like, all right, whatever. Let's fire off that special too. And we got one crit and it wasn't doing a lot of damage. And so I'm just like, okay, I see this could be a long fight. Now we're about to do the reverse controls, right? So I want him at a special two, but in Curse of Plague, that's going to reduce his um, power. And look at that, I got stunned. I was like, are you kidding me? I said, all right, you know what? She didn't seem to do very well, okay? So I'm just like, nah, we're not gonna do that. I, I, I love you, girl, but no, 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 no. I think, I think we'll just leave it, leave that alone. So um, still not gonna use Enchantress. So I uh, decided to go ahead and use Dust. Now, anytime I've used Dust and I don't know how to use her properly, I'm gonna tell you that right now. Every time I use Dust, she seems very slow. And so I'm just like, all right, well, I've already gotten two of the objectives down and I still have not really been playing this fight properly. And I know that, you know, Deathless Vision is coming up. And with Deathless Vision, I remember how bad Deathless King Brute was against Onslaught. That one almost made me cry. It was that bad. And so I'm like, man, I do not want to do that one, but I, I want to awaken. So I'm just like, all right, let's just see how well she does. All right. So we push him to a special two because it was going to be reverse controls. There we go. Evaded it. Cool, cool. All right. Now at this point, we can bait out a special one. And I'm looking at the uh, amount of health that's being uh, eaten away from him. And I'm like, already, I think she's doing a little bit better than uh, Claire. Or it might be that I'm getting more used to the fight. Because I know I need to get used to this fight if I'm going to take on uh, Toad with Deathless uh, Vision. Okay. So here we go. I do this. Fire a special two. And that don't do a lot of damage. So definitely leave a comment down below and give me some pointers on using dust. I have not gone to dust school yet. Okay. So I am definitely using her improperly. But I am learning this fight finally. Okay, and as long as I could get at least 20% off each time, I'm good. I'll use some of my abundant uh, revives. No problem, okay? So here we go, I'm trying to get them to do it. Fire that special too. There you go. Much easier to evade um, uh, when you have reverse control, okay? Now, in one of the attempts, you know, I'm seeing this and I'm like, okay, it doesn't seem like that's doing a lot of damage. So I'm probably needing to, to do something different. So you see, I, I tried the special one to see if that did more damage. And then I messed up there. As you can see why I ran forward was because I forgot about the reverse controls and this is what happens if the fight goes on too long and I'm not fully focused on it. I'll be fighting and I'll start thinking about something else like, okay, the special two isn't doing damage. Let me try the special one. Okay, that didn't work. So now what do I need? And at that point, I've done forgot about keeping track of the reverse controls and bam. Okay, but one thing that I saw was that if I mess up, I'm getting taken out regardless of my health. So no point in um, putting uh, uh, any health potions in, okay? So we're back again, and we did get an, a decent chunk off of them, okay? And I did watch some people use Viv Vision. Maybe 
uh, Viv Vision would have done better, even um, at a, a, what is she? I think she's uh, still ranked three. Okay, so that time I went and I just started getting smacked up. Don't ask me why. All right, anyway. I, I hit him with the special um, two to push him to a special two. All right, so now I want him to fire that special one off. All right, he did it. I didn't have to wait forever and a day. See, I'm blocking because I'm trying to push him to a special two. And I saw he wasn't going to make all the way to a special two. And so I hit him with the uh, special, which is eating away at my health, but... I'm still doing some damage, okay? So no matter what, we are whittling him down, all right? So now at this point, again, it's a root, all right? And at this point, you want to go to a special two, all right? Now this time I got him to a special two without needing my special uh, two to push him there, okay? So I'm like, okay, there we go. And I'm like, hey, this, that worked. And so I'm like, let me try something. All right. I went for a special three. I've not really done that with dust. So I don't know. But I did know that my health is so low that my recoil was going to do some damage. All right. And so I'm like, okay, what's going on here? All right. Let's just fire that off. And I'm like, whoa, whoa, whoa. I'm like, wait a minute. Did y'all see how much damage that did? I'm like, wait, so maybe that's what I need to do. So I'm like, okay, I think I, I got it now. I got to go to a special three and then start firing off my special. I'm like, okay, let's, let's see if that works. Because that did way more damage than I had done with my specials previously, right? So I'm like, okay. Let's uh, let's see if that works. All right, bait out the special one. Cool, cool. And now this is the problem. I have been using my specials to push him to his special two, okay? And I was backing him up there, all right? And then whole block there, okay? And then push him all the way to his special two. Great, all right? It's working, it's working. All right, now we just need to bait that out. There we go. All right, looking good. All right, uh-huh, uh-huh. And then special three. He's got a special one. So let's see what happens now. All right, so he's almost at a special two already, and I'm like, wait a minute. I don't want him at a special two. He's gonna tear me up. So I'm trying to get him to fire the special one. And as you can see, he don't want to do it. All right, there you go. Now, hit him with it. Look at that. And then he was stunned, and I was stunned that he was stunned. And so I was sitting there going, wait, why is he stunned? Look at this. I'm like, whoa. So that might be what I need to do. So I'm like, okay. That, that, that can work. Okay, so at this point here, I'm like, all right, after a special three, it gives him a lot of power and he usually is close to a special two. So at this point with Root, I just want him to fire his special one. And as you can see, he loves firing his special one. What's, what's going on, AI? What, what, what's this? What is this? This is what you see a lot of people complaining about. And he almost caught me there after all that time trying to get him to fire that special one. That ain't fun. All right, so now at this point, bam, fire that special two, and I mean special three, and hope I push him to a special two now. Now I want him at a special two. Okay, so here we go. Yeah. And he, I missed a whole bunch, and that time I went in, and I'm like, okay. So now I need him to fire that special, uh, there you go. Special two, cool. And that is how I needed to use, um, at least I think, dust. 
in this fight. Now I accidentally fired, um, got him to a special two, and I already know what's gonna happen. <laughs> now that caught me, okay? Because I looked and I'm like, okay, what am I supposed to be doing here? Is it reverse controls? Is it root? And I just choked. And I just said, let me just block. That ain't gonna help. So I'm just like, all right, well, whatever. Um, I shouldn't have pushed him to a special two like that. That was uh, my fault, my mistake there. Okay? But you see how you gotta do the fight. Um, Viv Vision, I think, is similar to this. But Dust, as you can see, could do the fight. You just have to play well. And and I was not. And again, I didn't know how to fight with her. And then I thought, okay, I'm just going to try to get him down quick. Yeah. Y you don't want to do that. Because he has that regen. And so I couldn't nuke him down even though he was already at low health. So I'm like, okay, okay. Let's just uh, do what we were doing before and get him down, okay? Don't try to, to speed it up because I was already tired uh, of this fight by now, okay? All right, see here? Just keep going. Mm -hmm. Bait it out, all right? All right, keep going. Um, don't Don't try to rush it. Bait it out, bait it out. Come on, come on back, come on back. There you go. All right, and then just keep... Just, all right, and then it was reverse control. And I was like, all right, whatever. Let's do this. Skadooshi. 1%. Really? He was at 2%, and my special 2 did 1% damage. Wow but we got him down without needing another revive. So I'm just like, okay, we're done with uh, the three objectives for Valiant. Now, the one that I dreaded the most, Deathless Vision. I have not used Deathless Vision. I'm not even all that familiar with Deathless Vision. But I said, all right, that was good practice. I know what I need to do in the fight now. Okay, basic strategy, keep him off the wall. If he has all those regens, back off, let the regens fall away. Then the other strategy is bait out a special one when it is uh, root, when you see that red hand thing. And I hadn't even changed the stat focus. That tells you how often I use him. Not at all. Um, but when it's that red hand, bait out the special one, then push him to a special two and bait that out when you have reverse controls. That is the basic strategy for this fight. Okay, so... <clears throat> I'm remembering vision and I'm remembering uh, the special one um, does a power drain and I think a, a, a heel block or something like that, right? And so I'm like, okay, maybe I can fight a little uh, harder if I can get the heel block, all right? Now I'm boosting up here because I'm thinking if I can get some power back, if I can do some damage and get power back, I can maybe spam more specials and get the fight down faster, okay? My, my, my strategy and my goal is usually how to get this thing down faster, all right? So I went ahead and, and boosted up because I don't really use tech um, boosts very often. So I'm like, all right, Let's see what uh, Deathless Vision is like. All right, so I'm like, all right, yeah, here we go. We're doing our basic strategy here. All right, there's the regen. All right, come on. Bait out that special one. Bam, all right. And I'm like, wait a minute. I don't see a, a heal block. 
I thought the special one did a heal block. So now I'm just like, Ugh. all right, whatever. So I'm holding my block because I want to push him to a special two. All right, here we go. Special two. Now I want to bait that out. Okay, cool, cool. Bang, great. Now, one thing I've noticed is I'm looking at Toad's health and his health is going down pretty nice. Bam! And I'm like, yeah, buddy. But still, no real heal block, but that did a, a nice little chunk of damage. It's looking nicer than Dust was, I'll tell you that. And so at this point, I'm like, hmm, maybe this won't be as bad as I was thinking it would be. All right, so again, I just get hit for no reason at all. Must like it, I don't know. Boom, and I'm like, wait, there's a heal block. That's exactly what I wanted. Why did it heal block there? And it didn't heal block before. Hmm. And I'm thinking about this and I'm like, okay. And you see, got the heal block up and it allowed me to get a little bit more aggressive and push him to a special two. And I'm like, huh, okay. Skadoosh. All right, that wasn't uh, a heal block there. All right, cool, cool. And so I'm like, all right, this is a root. Let's back him away because I don't have a heal block on. Let's get the um, regen stacks off of him. All right. And so I'm like, okay, that special two looks spicy. All right. So I'm going to try something. All right. I'm going to try something. I'm going to try to give him more power. Okay. Pluto. I'm like, oh, heal block. Yeah. Look at the damage already. I'm like, okay, this is definitely not, and then I got stunned. I'm like, seriously? Let's do that again. Skadoosh! There's the heal block. But it didn't drain all of his power. He had uh, um, one bar enough to hit me with a special and catch me like that. And I was like, but wait a minute. I'm not even mad about that because look at his health. That was my first try with Deathless Vision. That went better than Dust. I'm like, wait, 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 wait. Dust fight was worse than the Deathless Vision. I'm like, no way. So just so you know, I was not going to post this video. I was like, man, I just kind of did it and, and got it down or whatever. It's probably not going to help anybody. I don't know. But when I did this fight here, I was like, wait a minute. Look at that. I'm like, wait, wait, wait. Deathless Vision is doing some work in here. I'm like, okay. I'm seeing some um, uh, uh, Furies. All right. And so I'm just like, I may have to look into Deathless Vision. You know? I don't know if um, his, uh, I don't know what his Awakened ability is. But look at this. Look at that. He was missing me a second ago. And I'm just like, I really need to, to look at this. And I was starting to have a little bit of fun. Okay. I let them fall off because I knew that the um, heal block wasn't going to stay. All right. But this, look at this. So I'm hitting there. I'm just like, okay, I got five Furies up. And I'm doing a little bit of work here. Look at this. Spaboom. 74K crit. And the same thing happened that happened before. But I'm not mad. Because I'm actually having fun right now. I purposely pushed him up there. Hit him with a nice, big, fat special two. And of course, he followed it right up with a special one before I could really do anything. But I still did a lot of damage. And for some reason... They didn't like me. You saw what happened right there? It was just like blank. I had to come out, go back in. But I was like, this is going so much better and faster than the dust fight. And so I'm like, this is insanity. Now, maybe it's also a combination of the fact that I have now gotten used to the fight. You know? Um, you could say that as well, but mm, look at that. 
Nice heal block. Look at that. Look at that. Just tearing him up. Push him to a special two. There we go. All right. Now try to bait that out. Come on. Come on. Come on. I was actually, I'm serious. I was actually having fun with this. All right. Here we go. Ooh, interception. Come on. Yeah, buddy. Skaboosh. Look at that. 2% health. Oh, yeah, yes. Boom. I'm serious. I was having nightmares of King Groot against Onslaught. That fight almost brought me to tears. And I thought this was going to be similar. And it was not. I actually had uh, a little fun um, with this one. Okay? So don't be scared to use that Deathless Vision if you have him. And now I've got Deathless Vision Awakened. All right? So that is going to do it for the video, guys. Thank you all for watching. Take care. Hit the like button if you enjoyed the video. Leave a comment. Let me know what you thought about the video. A nice little common man uh, approach to this thing. Use your revives. Use some units. The rewards are worth it. All right? Take care. And you all have a blessed day. Arena and chill grind, that's how we roll No stress, no drama, just on patrol In the fight he swift, his tactics be tight Those shadows in the arena ready to ignite From the streets to the screen, his skills be renowned In the world of Marvel, Lord, the King Crown